it started. All right, I got my fire. So thank you very much. So in order to test for hydrogen, we put a um, flame under the test tube and we, we ask ourselves, is this going to make a little pop or is this going to make a big pop? And so I want you to watch the whole, um, watch the edge of the test tube as I do this. The flame is still going. The flame is still going, still going, still going. Just went out. Awesome. So what just happened is the sodium oxide that was in there was the cloud, and the cloud went down as the flame ate it up. And so it, the flame stayed in the mouth of the test tube while all of that uh, sodium oxide was eaten up. Uh, and, and it's reminiscent of the flame test that we did earlier in the year. So this was a spontaneous combustion using just sodium and water. If you are wanting to extend this, you could actually put some bromothymol blue in the water and notice that the water is going to stay blue because sodium hydroxide is one of the products because the sodium goes in the water. You can also do all kinds of things about how much water to how much sodium, but I didn't do that. I was just excited about seeing that cloud. Thank you. Bye.